Um, once again, I haven't uploaded in a little while, but I'm going to try to start uploading more again, especially now that we're back with more Madden, because I got five likes on the last video, and it took me a while to do this. So today, anyways, let's start the screen recording. Three, two, one, bam. There we go. Screen recording has started. And today we are going to start 45 second quarters, which will be obviously a lot more intense. Obviously the Niners, because that's my favorite team. They're doing okay this season. Um, Our main thing is running. So hard mode I suck at, easy mode I'm too good at, and medium mode I'm like, I, I won. The first time I tried medium mode, I won. Both times I've tried hard mode, I've lost. And easy mode, I just win all the time. So we're going to do medium, 45 second quarters, and yeah, let's go. So the reason for us doing 45 second quarters this time is because it's a bit harder. Like, what did I just accept a trade of? Uh, okay. I don't know who I just accepted a trade. Plus 14 overall though, so it was good. Release player? No, that's that's like our primary um, passing guy, so we're going to keep him in. And let's play our first game. Here we go. Against the Titans. And we are pretty cracked now. Turn the volume down. We're doing pretty good. Um, screen recording is going. We unfortunately did not get first half kickoff. So, pretty much in 45 second quarters, it pretty much takes the whole half to get a run. Occasionally, you'll be able to get more runs. And then if you go long passes, you'll be able to get a lot of runs. But my team never catches the long passes too often. So, that never happens. But... I think we'll be fine. We got the sack. I'm going to try to not run before the play. Every time I don't get a sack, they always gain so much yardage. Like, if that, if I didn't get that last sack, that would have been a first down right now. And I also hate when I just run past them. <laughs> like, that's the worst. But we have an early stop. So, that is pretty good. So, there is the punt. We are about to get taken out. We won't. Oh, we're going. Okay. We're good. We're good. Run. Okay. So, running is a lot harder now. Obviously expected. We'll run right here. See, no more long runs. There's the occasional exception where you'll get a really good run. But you really don't get long runs too much. Oh, I almost broke free there. So, let's see. Do we have my favorite, like, long pass? Okay, so this pass comes in short pass and long pass, and it's just great. Like, Kittle is just wide open every time, and it's just great. In easy mode, that comes in in the short pass menu, but here it comes in in the long pass menu. I don't know why. Well, they're actually two different plays, but they both have Kittle running the same route in them. So, that was not... A good play call so we're gonna just run in just straight for it and we will get the touchdown so pretty good right now and you'll notice that i'm like very stupid in this game like sometimes it'll be fourth down and instead of punting i'll just go for it when it's like fourth and six this is one of those reasons. Onside kicking. I love to just onside kick and see if I'll maybe get the ball. Which, it, it doesn't happen too often, but it sometimes happens and it's great when that does happen. So they have 13 seconds left in the half to get something and I completely miss the sack again. And, uh, God. Okay. That was almost a touchdown. So one bad thing about onside kicks is they're like literally so close to the end zone. Get him. Ugh. Interception! Pick six! Get up! Get up! Come on, man. Get your bum off the ground. No, 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 no. I don't want this play. Time out. Time out. Even though that's probably the play that I should use now, I want to use this one. Because this play is actually more successful. As long as I don't get sacked, of course. But. 
The thing that sucks about this game is there's no flag, so sometimes it'll be like a clear pass interference and it just doesn't call it. Like they'll knock him out of the sky as he's jumping for the football and they just won't call it. And it just frustrates me because it's like, oh my god, that's such pass interference, it's insane. Like, how am I supposed to catch it? And another thing that sucks is number 60, when I run that play, always just blocks me and then I get tackled. So. Oh, we almost got taken out there. Get the first. Yes. So, one of my most successful medium pass plays, PA pass, is this play. Where they both run this way. I can hit them almost every time. Either Kittle or Johnson. I can hit them every time pretty much there's like one occasionally they'll get a block off of it but it usually doesn't happen too often so i'll usually run between the four plays that i've really chosen so far the four running plays um so that would be this hb stretch hb toss zero one trap and hb power sweep those are pretty much my primary running plays that i'll use and then PA pass, I will use the PA jet sweep, and then for long pass, I'll usually use the RB circles or the four verticals. Just to explain my play style, for short passes, I'll technically use whatever. I don't really use short passes too often, because they always get intercepted. What a bro, I barely got that off. Yeah. If you heard that spray, that was like um, a spray for my fan's litter box because it always stinks. So we got like a spray. See number sixty, he blocked me again. Oh no! Oh no! I want I want another touchdown. Please snap it. Run. Call timeout. Call time. Oh, one second left. Dude, let's go. Easy touchdown. Let's go! So yeah, these videos will definitely be shorter, like it's already over. But, they are a lot more intense, especially if I start losing. But this game, luckily, we started out with a win. So thank you guys for watching this video. Make sure to like and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.